Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, it's going to be really quick and short. I'm going to be making a very simple Freddie Mercury cake. It is my cousin's birthday today and we're celebrating. He loves the band Queen and Freddie Mercury is the main one. I was going to go to a store called Candies because they print out edible images. And I was going to do something like this but with, but with yellow to kind of match his like famous jacket. I honestly don't know much of like the band. But from what I've looked at, like when I looked up like Freddie Mercury cakes, there's a lot of cakes themed after his yellow jacket. So I was going to do the trim yellow instead. But I decided just to do a very simple cake. I have three 8 inch chocolate cakes that I still need to cut so that they'll be even. We ended up finding this cake topper on Amazon. It's just Freddie Mercury and then it says happy birthday. He always imitates like this pose. So I thought that this was perfect. I'm just going to do an 8 inch three layer white cake. And then I'm going to do a little trim of yellow. So I'm going to get started with evening out the cake layers so that we can start decorating. Okay guys, so I just finished cutting all the layer of cakes so that they'll be even. Um, now what I need to do is, I'm gonna do the crumb coat really quick. the cake in the fridge right now it's the crumb coat I am gonna be putting food coloring into the frosting so that I can make the trim I just don't know if I should do lemon yellow or buttercup yellow so this one's a lot more like yellow and this is a little bit more like warm I might put a little bit of both just so that way it's not too bright but not too dark it looks a little past on the camera but in person it looks like maybe the perfect yellow I don't know if the camera will pick up the color that it ended up coming out Right there. It's a little darker than what it looked in the bowl. I ended up using tip 1M. I also already put frosting into my 790. I like using this one to go around the whole cake because it gives it like an even amount of frosting all over the cake when you're smoothing it out. This is the cake and then I'm going to do the trim also up on top so all these edges like that look really bad. Won't look that bad. Either way we'll put this on top of the cake and the bumps won't really matter. Let's do the trimming really quickly. Um, if I sound like if I'm in a rush it's because I kind of... <laughs> I kind of am because I'm also making my little cousin's birthday cake because tomorrow they're having her birthday party. So I also need to get that done. If you guys can see in the background, it's going to be Buzz Lightyear themed. I will be doing a separate video for that. I think I'm gonna do like little twisties up on the top kind of big I do feel like if it's missing something so I'm going to be using this edible gold glitter dust 
And then I'm just gonna spray it all over the cake because I do feel like it's missing a little something. It ended up with a big yellow stain. This is how the cake ended up coming out. I think it's very simple. We're gonna be celebrating his birthday today, so I will vlog a little bit. I'm gonna end the video right here. I hope you guys did enjoy today's video. If you did, make sure to leave a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on your post notifications. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye. Happy birthday, dear Chato.